the average weight of killer whales is between 8,000 and 12,000 pounds, so if they are washed off the ocean and onto land, their odds of making their way back to the water on their own are minimal, and tragically, if they do not, they are certain to die. However, that was not the case with this distressed orca, who became stranded on rocks after the tides washed it to the shore while looking for food. Its unfortunate situation, however, drew the attention of locals who made it their mission to keep it alive until the tides returned six hours later, keeping it wet by pouring buckets of water over it. The people became more creative when they switched to utilizing a fire hose hooked to a pump to continuously wet the orca until the NOAA arrived. Nonetheless, when the NOAA arrived, they made sure the locals who had kept the orca alive for hours left, but they also made sure to let the orca return to the water when the tides returned and allow it to find its pod. Back in July 2015, a female orca became stranded on the British Columbia coastline when the tides that carried her there failed to return her. And with a weight of 10,000 pounds, it couldn't effortlessly make its way back and was stuck until the tides returned eight hours later. Fortunately for the killer whale, there were caring rescuers all along the coast. These rescuers made certain that it was kept damped and covered with cloths so that the orca would not be damaged by the rough rocks around it. Nonetheless, the water along the coast began to rise eight hours later, much to the delight of the orca, who was now finally able to make it back to its pod. Yes! Oh my god! Oh! Aside from their massive weight, it's worth noting that their dorsal fin may grow up to two meters tall, and as a result, adult orcas can be almost as big as a bus, which might be a problem for tens of rescuers trying to save them when they are stranded. Regardless, despite its size, Tens of determined rescuers made sure to release the orca back into the water in this video. In September 2019, seven orcas were washed up on the coast of La Calita in Argentina's Buenos Aires province. Fortunately for the orcas, the locals made an effort to assist them, although their massive weight initially proved to be a challenge. The small number of locals quickly grew as firefighters, civil defense, the prefecture, and local biologists rallied together to return one of the orcas to the ocean. But no matter how hard they tried, they couldn't carry the massive orca. Despite getting soaked by the tides, the rescuers were adamant about returning the orca to the water. The orca finally made it back to the waters and was able to swim away after many hours and attempts. Regardless, only six of the seven orcas were saved as one of them later died.
Orcas can be found in all of the world's oceans, from the Arabian Sea to the Atlantic Ocean and from the Arctic waters to Antarctica. They are not constricted, as they could be found anywhere regardless of temperature. Therefore, it came as no surprise when four orcas were discovered in the freezing waters off the coast of Russia, close to Starodovsky village, between blocked ice and shallow coastal waters. Unfortunately, they got stuck in the icy waters, causing them significant distress. Nonetheless, they were discovered by some rescue workers who used a small boat to reach the killer whales and risked the icy waters to save the orcas, who were 50 to 100 meters from the coastline. The waters were apparently shallow and littered with stones, and as such, the orcas became stranded in the middle of the night, prompting rescuers from the Russian Emergency Ministry to shift the ice to create openings for the orcas to swim through. After several hours, they were able to rescue three of the orcas, including one calf, and were forced to remain in the ice with the fourth until the high tide allowed it to join the others. Adult male orcas can grow to be 32 feet long, while females can grow to be 28 feet long. A newborn orca, however, is around eight and a half feet long and weighs between 265 and 353 pounds. So even though they appear to be small, they are frequently too huge to swim out to sea at low tide. That was the case with this calf orca, which was stranded in Gertner Bay in Magadan Oblast, a Russian region. The orca, which got caught at a depth of roughly 80 centimeters of water, couldn't get back to the ocean and was therefore stranded, but cried out for assistance. Fortunately for the calf, a group of rescuers heard its cries and came to its aid. However, no matter how hard these rescuers pushed the orca, it did not move, and as a result, Dozens of Magadan people quickly joined the rescuers to keep the orca alive. As the water began to rise during high tides, the rescuers attempted to shove the terrified orca once more. The orca eventually gave in and swam back into the sea, where its mother had been waiting all along. Orcas, as social as they can be, are still largely hunted in some nations, such as Greenland. However, in many other countries, they are not chased or left to die if found helpless. And one of these numerous occurrences occurred in Denmark in April 2022, when an orca was left out by the tides while hunting for food. This rescue effort included eight individuals attempting to push the stranded killer whale back to the high seas. But as the push was futile, they proceeded to wrap a rope around the orca. The rope, which had been attached to the killer whale, was then fastened to a boat. The boat was then utilized to transport the whale to higher ground in the hope that the orca would finally swim away. 